We just bought this abandoned storage unit for $400. We're trying to find profitable items to sell on eBay. I have no idea what we're in for, and to be honest, I'm kind of excited to see what's inside. Oh. <laughs> We've got all of this to sift through. There's a trolley up the top there. Look, that's the first one. <laughs> Plus problems. That's <laughs> unreal. How appropriate. So without any time to waste, we started pulling out the boxes and it didn't take long for us to find some really profitable items. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Lucas Films. It's the Bunnikin's Royal Dalton. Oh, it is the Royal Dalton. Yeah, yeah. it's the Royal Dalton. It's just another they're one as cups. well. I think they're little egg cups, yeah. They're actually good. Yeah, yeah they're cute. <laughs> so it's willow tree, yeah? Yep. Uh, what is it? Is it ceramic? Is that ceramic as well? Or is that kind of like... It's more like it, plaster. It's more like plaster, yeah. That's, it's a decorative yeah, item. That's pretty cool. This item was so unassuming. Willow tree figurine by Susan Lordy. This thing goes for $75 in brand new condition. And we deemed the one that we had to be pretty much like new. You got that? That's good. That's nice. That's nasty, but... Come on, dude, that's like 40 bucks. A Vinny's <laughs> gift card. <laughs> two bucks. Oh, that's a rare two dollar one too. Oh, I've got a Vinny's <laughs> gift card. <laughs> Value of twenty five dollars. So we've got a we've got a notice to appear in court here for the possession of a dangerous drug. <laughs> so we, this is a drug this is a drug dealer storage unit. <laughs> I won't go into too much detail here, but we found a few other things that definitely confirmed it. Court notice. Jeez, you reckon she used that as well? Yep, definitely. But there's nothing on the end of it, so yep. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> it's a baby. Oh, dude. And then take the, take the other head away. Oh. <laughs> dude, that's, that's pretty creepy. That's horrendous. Party oh, here we go. Oh, binoculars. You panda. Panda, huh? You can see me? I can see Can you, you see my future? I can see your future. Am I making money? <laughs> Beautiful. It's magical. <laughs> it's magical. Maybe we've got some really good surfboards. Right at the back. Right at the back. But right later, the back. On. Uh, later on. Perfect. It's a Dell. I don't know what sort though. It's a Dell. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> some, probably some charges here too. That's sort of walked away. Yeah. It is old. It's cracked here. Oh, there. Yeah. It's cracked there. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. But maybe for parts. Maybe. That's a cool one. Makita. A charger. A, uh, oh, yeah. Drill. Oh, the That'll go well. well that it works. That should do well. So that's the Makita DTD154. So that impact driver goes for about $100. And we also found another Makita, the DHP482, that went for about $80, plus a third one. So there's some good money in tools. We just keep coming. Oh, no, here we go. Oh, here we go. Some DVDs, hey? Oh, TV series. Madman, it's sealed as well. It's sealed? It's sealed. Anything sealed's going to be a big win. Oi, this one. Full set. Full oh, set with seal. Another one. Full set. Here we go, another one. <laughs> oh, that's epic. If that's complete as well. Oh, there's more in there too. There's a little seal underneath here. Oh, get them all out. There we go, all sealed. <laughs> full that set. All sealed. What do we got there? Series two, three. That one's sealed. Four and five and six and final series part two. Final series part one. Final series part so one. series one. We just need series one. What's that one right there? Series one. That's oh. the one. That's the one. Here we go. All brand new. Oh, that's a big win. Plenty of reasons for Jackson and I to be excited with this DVD find. There is some serious money in the DVD category. Mad Men, the complete season, brand new, worth about a hundred bucks. Centipede was worth about twenty-five dollars pre-owned, as was Vikings. And then this Hamlet's uh, TV series, season one, there were comps between thirty to fifty dollars. Maybe are any of them brand new? Nah. Oh, flip them the other way. Nah, not really. Nah, none of them. All pre -owned. But these though. But those ones are the new ones, so that's good. Is this brand new as well? That one's not. No. So they obviously watched season one, yeah, hated, and then it. hated it. Hated <laughs> it. Yeah. Then they got rid Hopefully of it. Hopefully, someone out there likes it. No, they will. That's, I've actually watched every episode. I love that show. 
While Amanda took a load to the tip and the op shop, it was up to Jackson and I to sift through the remainder of this massive storage unit and we found something that was gonna predict our future. Hey Jax, I found, yeah. a, I found a magic eight ball. Here we go. Wish to see if we're gonna make any money. We're we gonna make it. There you go. So it shall be. So it shall be. If this is in here, that is gonna be really good. A Thrustmaster TSPC Racer Ferrari 488 for the Windows PC. Hey Jax, let's get this out now and we'll have a look at it. Is it heavy? I don't think so. You don't, I don't think, think so? I think it's in this one. Damn! It doesn't look like it. Damn it! There is a Buzz Lightyear. There is a Buzz Lightyear. That's cool. He's in good nick too. To Buzz. infinity and beyond! Russ Teddies? A lot of Teddies. Peter Alexander one. Oh, Peter Alexander, that's Peter good. Alexander that's a good one. With the right tag. <laughs> Two minute noodles. <laughs> We're gonna have lunch. Remember these? I don't, I don't even think I had one. That's, wow. how, that's how old they are. Wow. What do you Remember got? It? $10 note. Oh, that's Ooh. sweet. It's in there, it's nice and, $10 nice and note. sealed. What year? What year is that? Commemorative from when? Oh, it says this commemorative note will be printed in issue only 1988. A 1988. I wonder what that's worth. Yeah. I'll put the comps up. Turns out this single $10 note actually sells for $50 on eBay, and if you've got four of them, you'll make yourself about 200 What a find. That's sweet. All right. What's Use going, it. Use it. Next one? Use it to get in there. <laughs> These things are worth a bit, though. We've got the car maximum strength cross strike sledgehammer. That's a good find. That's cool. All right. Sledge it. Sledge it. What do you got? Tip it all out. I'm not, I'm not Australian. Hey, not Australian? I'm not Australian. Had our SNMDs. Nice. I think it's a small pair. What size? What size are they? Uh, eight. eight. Eight and six and a half UK. So yeah, that's women's. The women's. Mm. And they're in good condition. Good condition anyway. Nice. Oh. Oh. Oh, all that cool. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, cool. Oh, you get the pair. That's the pair. What size? That's the pair. That's what you want to see. US 9. 9 and men's. then what? Eight and a half. Yeah, they're men's. Is this? Oh, <gasps> that's Nike <Nighty> high tops. <laughs> pretty, pretty, what? pretty wrecked. They are interesting. Nike. <laughs> <laughs> that's so wild. That's crazy. That, those Adidas's are in good condition. They're not too bad, are they? This bicycle seat though, giant. That's a good brand. I don't know what model it is, but these things, that looks in new condition. Oh, some, some work shoes in that. Work boots look good. They look, they haven't been worn. They're great. Blacksmith. Brand new, yeah. Brand new, this should do well. These calculators can be worth quite a bit of money. The FX100 AU Plus. I think it goes for about 30 bucks. And this one is working. All right, we're probably just over halfway through now, I reckon. And we've found some pretty cool stuff. I can't wait to get those surfboards out though. They're gonna be good. But we've looked at everything here. This is stuff that we're not yet throwing away. We think we're gonna be keeping. There's relative value to pretty much all of this stuff here. Um, but everything else has been put into the back of the car and we're going to be taking that down to the tip. Uh, but there's some pretty good stuff in here and I think we've definitely already made our money back. But we just need to dive back in and finish off what else is in here. Records. Here we go. This could be anything. Could be this could be really good. Could be something. Oh yeah. I thought we'd definitely be in for some luck here with these records, but as you can see, I, I don't think there's any resale value associated to any of these, which was a little bit disappointing. Nice old time. And oh, that's a lot of money. Damn, I was really hoping that was actually going to be good, but I don't think there's anything in there. Some Air Force Ones, seven youth. They're in pretty good condition. They're not the worst. Get about 40 for those. 
She definitely did not have a good taste in clothing. None of these brands are good. Oh, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> got money. Is that American money? Are they dollars or are they more than dollars? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. There's nearly your flat money over there. That'll get me a beer. <laughs> That'll get me a beer over there. Happy days. Balling. Last couple bits left, hey? Now I think these, I think this one's spent. Actually, they both can be good. We've got the fins on the back as well. FCS. Carl Hass. Carl Hassel. These fins are actually worth a lot. Those FCS fins, yeah, they're not too bad. And the board's in pretty decent nick. A couple of dings. A couple of dings, but there's no. A couple of rocks. <laughs> yeah, there's been a few rocks, but you could take it out. I took these ones home and I spoke to a really good mate of mine and he actually said that they were worth about $80 for the pair. So I'm going to go ahead and list these up on the Facebook Marketplace and given the Gold Coast is really well known for its surfing, I think somebody out there is no doubt going to try and snap these up and $80 would be a really good return. I pulled everything across with jacks and we basically just allocated everything that you can see here. It all had an eBay comp associated to it. So we got, we had a really good estimate of how much we thought the day's resale value was going to be, but that didn't account for everything else that we thought was going to be of some value that we were yet to calculate. So we've had a look at everything and there's about 1,200, about 1,200 there. And then we haven't even gone through any of this as well. So we've still got to sift through all of that too. But I don't know, we've been out here for how long? About four hours. Four hours maybe. <laughs> We're sifting through all this and we've got, we've got a fair bit of stuff. And remember we paid 400 for it. So um, it's been fun. Not too bad. Hey Jax, where do people need to search to find your YouTube channel? Oz Treasure Hunters. Oz Treasure Hunters. We're gonna put a link in the description. Go and check him out because we've just found a whole heap of cool stuff today. Over $1,200, bro. Over $1,200 and he's got a rad YouTube channel.